A very special edition of Commodore Call here with Coach Trundy as the Falmouth Commodores are your 2016 Western Division champs. Now, Coach, that hasn't happened since 2004. What are the emotions for you right now? Well, I'm very, very happy for the organization and certainly happy for the kids. You know, uh, they've worked really hard and, you know, hey, I'm blessed with three great coaches who, who just, you know, bust their butt every single day to help them and, and an organization that works around 65 days a year to provide them with an opportunity. And, you know, you don't get to where you are without kids having talent, but I, th I do believe it takes a lot more than that. I think it, you know, it, it takes an investment on their part in each other and, and having a great time and, and believing in each other. And, uh, you know, they really come together and uh, I'm really, really happy for, for them and the entire organization. Now, as the game progressed here, what was the emotion like in the dugout as it kind of became a certainty that you guys were going to clinch the West? You know, it really wasn't a, a, a hot item, to be honest <laughs> with you. I just think, you know, once again, we've been so focused on trying to play uh, good baseball and, and win each inning and execution. And, you know, our pitching staff just went out and dominated tonight, I thought. I thought Jake was outstanding. And, and then to follow up with, with Brady and Steven and Corbin, I mean, holy smokes, you know, I mean, they just... Uh, you know, we're electric tonight. So, uh, you know, and we jumped out in front. You know, I, I wish we could have extended a lead a little bit more, but hey, that's that's kind of being nitpicky on my part. <laughs> so I, uh, I was really pleased with the overall effort, and I think that's what we were focused on more, to be honest with you, than, than uh, being able to, you know, hey, uh, secure what we just did. <laughs> Jake Bird showed some tough guts out there. He got knocked in the head on that play on first baseline. Did he have any idea of coming out there? Or did he want to stay in? Jake, Jake is such a competitor. You know, I mean, uh, he works so hard. You know, he, he runs <laughs> 80 miles a day, I swear, and, and throws and throws and throws. And he just wants the baseball every single second. And I think I probably would have had to pry it out of his hand to take him out of the game. And he did. He, he took a pretty good shot. And, you know, within a second, I think once he realized that all parts were still in place, uh, you know, he was ready to go back in. And, you know, he's a tough kid, but he's a, he's a very, very competitive kid who who once again, uh, you know, is, is a guy who, hey, wants the ball, but he wants it in an unselfish way. He, he's a teammate, and uh, we're very, very fortunate to have Jake. Back end of the bullpen's been strong for a long time for the Commodores this season so far. What is the attributed to that? Is it Landry? Is it the players? What's been the key? It's a little bit of everything. Mike does such such a great job with our pitches. You know, he earns their trust, you know, and that's important. You know, I think they're extremely comfortable with Mike, and. Uh, you know, that, that's, that's an important part of the whole process. But once again, you know, uh, I don't want to diminish the fact that, you know, we have some talented kids, you know, but it always does take more than that. And there's a lot of people that have talent that don't, don't reach their potential. And, you know, I think these kids continually each day are working to get better. And I think a lot of that comes from Mike and a lot of that comes from their, their own makeup too as well, where they're kids that just want to, hey, you know, today's another opportunity to get to get better, and, and uh, the next time I'm out there, you know, hopefully I can throw the ball better than I did the last time. <laughs> All right, Coach, thanks for your time. Hope you enjoy the victory and go have some fun tonight, but appreciate you coming on as always. Thanks, Blake. I really appreciate the job all you guys do. Thank you. All right, thanks, Coach. <laughs> thanks, guys.